Hi, everyone. We are here just a few minutes early, and we are hoping that you are a little bit early too. Uh, we're very excited to bring to you Zippy the Zebra live on our Power of Play Facebook page. So if you are here, please drop us a comment and tell us your name. Uh, tell us um, your little one's name. Uh, and make sure you got a favorite toy because your toy can join our puppets in this story. I'm Sulochna Disanayaka from Power of Play Private Limited. And we're just lining up to bring you Zippy the Zebra live on Power of Play. Go ahead, type a comment and say, if you're here, who are you with? Are you watching with your family? Your kids' names? Yeah, that's great. Hi, Sanati, welcome. <laughs> great. Just got one more minute to go. Just let our friends join in. Yeah. Welcome. We have 14 who have joined us. Make sure you type in the comments and tell me your little one's name um, or your name. You don't have to have a little one. Big ones are also welcome to watch. Uh, hi, hi, Arusha and family. Welcome. Great. We are at 4.30 on the dot. Welcome, Ala. And we are going to start our story, Zippy the Zebra. Welcome, everybody. I'm Sulochna Disanayaka from Power of Play Private Limited. This story comes to us from a land far, far, far away. A land where animals roamed freely, just like they did thousands of years ago. A land where men, women, and children wear the most fabulous hairstyles and sing and dance all day long. A land named Africa. Ula, mula kelebe, mula kelebe, se sa kwa sa gom gom tu. Ula, mula kelebe, mula kelebe, se sa kwa sa gom gom tu. Lama kaba kami bola kata mata yada pades wasin on wemi. Lama kaba kami bola kata mata yada pades wasin on wemi. Lama kaba kami bola kata mata yada pades wasin on wemi. Lama kaba kami bola kata mata yada pades wasin on wemi. In this land lived a whole herd of zebras. Zippy was a baby zebra who belonged to that herd. Hi, Zippy. Ha. Ha. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Can you say hi to your friends? Ha. Ha. Hi. Ha. Hello. I'm Zippy. Zippy, tell your friends what you love to do, your all-time favorite. I, I, I love to ch ch chase ba, 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 ba. butterflies. Butterflies. Yo, 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 Ajina jina we, ajina jina wa, ajina jina we, ajina jina wa. Yo 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 yo. Zebi. Papa. How many times have I told you not to chase the butterflies? Papa. No buts. 
Do you remember what happened to cousin Zonda? Sir, Sir Zonda got e e eaten by a lion. <gasps> oh, Zippy darling. Yes, Mama. I know you love to chase butterflies, but it's just not safe, dear. You have to stick to your herd. But Ma, zebras are boring. All we do is eat, 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 drink some water, go to sleep. <coughs> eat, 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 drink some water, go to sleep. <coughs> eat, 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 drink some water, go to sleep. Hey. Papa? I don't care if it's boring. It's safe. Stick to your herd and stay alive. Sippy was heartbroken. Have you ever felt like that when you really wanted to do something, but your mom or dad said, no, you cannot do that. Have you ever felt like that? Yes. Can you tell us in the comments, like what kind of stuff makes you feel like Sippy feels right now? Hmm. Zippy went to take a quick drink of water when suddenly someone fascinating swam by. A jinana na we, a jinana na we, a jinana na we, a jinana na we. Oh, I'm sorry, Sugar. Did I scare you, baby? Uh, 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 who are you? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I, babies? <laughs> That's right. I'm a fish. I'm Francine the fish. Sugar, nice to meet you, baby. Nice to meet you, babies, too. <laughs> For Francine, I'm, I'm Zippy, the baby zebra. Hello, baby. Nice to meet you. Mwah. Tell me, Zippy, why you look so worried? For Francine, did, did you ever stick to a herd? 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 Oh, no, baby. I never stuck to a herd, honey. I never even stuck to a school of fish. Never stuck to a school of fish? No, baby. I swam wherever my heart carried me. I swam in waterfalls. I swam in lakes. I swam in oceans. I even swam in a pond once. A pond? Yeah, and I've even been to the Red Sea, sugar. Red Sea? Wow. That's far. Oh, yeah, baby. I've got myself all kinds of friends. I've got myself sea horses and sea turtles. And I'm even best friends with a big blue whale. Can you believe that? Whale? Wow. Yeah. And if I want to, I can even swim on land like this. Wow, really, Francine? Really, sugar? So you don't worry about sticking to no herd, baby? Is it okay for me to chase b -b butterflies? Butterflies, caterpillars, snails, octopuses. You chase whatever you want to, baby. But make sure you come home before dark, okay? Come home before dark. Dark. Yes, the savannah is no place for babies after dark, okay? Okay, Francine. Thanks, Francine. Sure, baby. Mm. You just keep swimming, sugar. Bye-bye. Wow. F -f Francine says it's okay to, to chase butterflies as long as I'm home before dark. Do you guys think I should chase butterflies? What do you think? Go on, tell us. Should Zippy chase the butterflies? Go on, tell us. Type it in the comments. What are they saying, Silo? Wait, wait, wait. We're going to wait. Should Zippy chase the butterflies? What do you guys think? Yes? 
Yes, Anya says yes. Okay, anyone else? Oh, do you think Siki should just stick to a herd and just be friends with zebras? Nobody else. Yes. Oh, Priscilla says yes too. Yusra says yes too. Wow, we have some brave viewers. <laughs> Anyone feel, no, no, this is not a good idea. Zippy should just stick to his herd. Anyone feel like that? Sabiha says, no. Okay, Sabiha's not feeling too sure about this. Anyone else feels like no? Mm. Oh, please, please, please. Mahin from Candy saying yes too. Seth says, no, big no from Seth. <laughs> Sariut says yes. Okay. Please, guys, please. I've been in lockdown for two months just with zebras. I'm tired of zebras. May I please chase the butterflies? I promise I'll come home before dark. Sansa says yes. You know what? Majority is saying yes. So let's go with yes. But make sure. Yes, yes, yes. I'll come home before dark. Okay. All right, Zippy started to chase the butterflies. Yo, 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 Yo 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 Soon it was completely dark. Oh! Papa? Oh! Oh no, I, I think I'm lost. <laughs> homeless, homeless, moonlight sleeping in a midnight lake. We are homeless, homeless. Moonlight sleeping in a midnight lake. As Zippy cried and cried in the savannah in the middle of the night, far away from his herd, somebody new walked by. Hi, Bo, hi, Bo, everybody says. Hi, Bo, hi, Bo, everybody says. Ash, brother, why are you crying, little one? The night is not the time to cry, no. The night is the time to party, no. Hi, Bo, hi, Bo, everybody says. But who are you? Who am I? Who am I? You come into my homeland and you ask me who I am? I am Modu Donke, the monkey, the coolest monkey in this whole land, brother. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Modu Donke, I'm... Z -Z Zippy, the zebra. Hey, Zippy, nice to meet you, Zippy. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my part of the savannah, brother. Hey, where is your mama and papa, Zippy? I am lost. <laughs> I went away from the herd. Herd? Herd? <laughs> I cannot believe what I just heard. Hey, listen, baby zebra, you don't have to stick to no herd, brother. I don't? No, Maju Donkey never stuck to a herd. If I want to swing from the branches, I swung from the branches like a gibbon. Even though I'm a chimpanzee, I can swing like a gibbon. Yes, yes. If I want to walk on land like you, baby, I walked on land. If I want to take a deep dive into the ocean, I took a deep dive into the ocean. But uh, of course, only with life jacket. Yes, no going swimming without no life jacket, okay? Wow, really, Madu Donkey? Really, really. And because of that, I am the coolest monkey in the whole of Africa, brother. 
Really? Really. Everybody wants money. Don't get at their parties. The hippos want me. The giraffes want me. Even the lions want me. But I don't go to their parties because I don't trust no lion. Yes, 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 yes. Really? Really, really. But eh, the savanna is no place for babies after dark, no? Eh, I help you. I help you. You can help me? Yes, yes, I can help you. But first, I have to go to a party. Party? Yes, yes. Baby hippo is turning one, and mama hippo will be very upset if I don't come for their birthday party. So you stay right here. Mother donkey will go to the party and come back and help you, okay? Oh, oh, oh okay. Okay, okay. Stay right here. If you need anything from anyone, tell them. You are Madhu Donke's brother, okay? Okay. Okay, bye-bye. Hi, Bo. Hi, Bo. Everybody says, eh, hi, Bo. Hi, Bo. Everybody says, hi, Bo. Hi, Bo. Wow. Madhu Donke says, it's, it's okay. It's okay to go away from the herd. Do you guys, do you guys believe that? Have you met anyone like Madhu Donkey in your real life? Someone who's so cool and so brave all the time? Have you? Tell us, tell us in the comments if you have. While Zippy thought of everything that Madhu Donkey said, suddenly someone else crashed into him. Oh, please don't. Please don't eat me, 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 please don't eat me. I, I, I don't eat animals. You don't? Oh, thank goodness. Ah, ah, the lions, they're everywhere, they're everywhere. They're going to eat me, they're going to eat you. What are you doing in the middle of the savannah, in the middle of the night? What are you doing? I, 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 what's your name? I'm Z -Z Zippy the Zebra. Oh, hello, Zippy. I'm Cornell the Cheetah, and I'm petrified of lions. You're a cheetah, and you're scared of lions? Yes, petrified. They eat us all the time. That's why we hide. Always we're hiding. People think we're shy, but really, we're just hiding from the lions. <sighs> what are you doing here? <laughs> I got lost from my heart. I was chasing butterflies. Butterflies, butterflies. Oh, that's a fabulous idea. You're going to be Lion Desert tonight. Lion Desert? Oh, no. But Madhu Donkey said, Madhu Donkey, Madhu Donkey, did you meet that crazy monkey? Did Sippy meet that crazy monkey? What did he say? He said, oh, I bet he said he's the coolest monkey in the whole of Africa, right? Yeah, and he said it's okay not to stick to a heart. Oh, did he say that? Oh, how wonderful. Is he here now? Is he here to save you from the liars? Is he here? I can't see him. Where is he? Where is Madhu Donkey? What? Pa party? He went to a party leaving Zippy all alone here? Oh, what a star, really? Yeah, he said the baby hippo's birthday. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, it's the baby hippo's birthday. But still, how could he leave you? You know what? I'm gonna go get that monkey and give him a piece of my mind. You wait right here, Zippy. Stay right here and don't talk to strangers, okay? Whatever you do, don't talk to strangers. Okay, I, I, I won't, I won't speak to, speak to strangers. All right, all right, stay right here. Madhu don't care. <laughs> Oh boy, Madhu Donkey. Ah, Madhu Donkey said it's okay to go away from the herd, but but Cornell says I'm going to be the lion's desert. Oh, what do you think? Will I really be the lion's desert? What do you guys think? Who's right? Madhu Donkey or Cornell? Tell us. While Zippy thought about all of this, he got very thirsty. It was too much thinking for a little baby. He slowly went to get another drink of water. 
while he was drinking water, somebody new walked by again. Boomf, 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 boodoo, boomf, 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 boodoo, boomf, 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 boodoo, boomf, boomf, boomf. Allo? Allo, Moss? Oh, yes, Moss. It is Poppy Perez, your trusted supplier, Moss. And wait, wait. Signal is breaking up. Hello? Hello? Can you? Uh, oh, yes, yes. Hello? Yes, yes. Tell me, what do you want? Oh, yes, I can supply any skin from the savannah. Freshest skin at the best price, Moss. Sorry? Speak louder. You want zebra skin? Eh? Sorry, sorry. Zebra, we out of stock because of corona, no? No zebras. Maybe I give you lion, big lion. No? No, you only want zebra? Eh? Tough customer, no? Okay, okay, maybe, maybe, uh, maybe I get you zebra, uh, maybe I try, maybe, <gasps> oh, who is that? Hey, boss, you wait, wait, okay, I, I FaceTime you in five minutes, okay? Okay, no, maybe Zoom, okay, five minutes, five minutes, okay? <sniffs> oh, look at that, a baby zebra just when I need one. Hey, hey it is Perez at lucky night, no? Let's try my luck. Boomf, 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 voodoo, boomf, boomf, boomf. Hello? Hello, Moss? <laughs> eh, what's the matter? Hello? Can you hear me? Hello? I, I'm sorry, but I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Oh, clever zebra, no? I'm not a stranger, Moss. I am Poppy Paris, your trusted penguin. No, what is your name, baby? I'm Sippy, the, the zebra. Hello, Zippy. Welcome, welcome. Where is your mama and papa? I'm lost. <laughs> oh, excellent, excellent. <laughs> you don't worry, Moss. We help lost babies all the time. Let me just touch you a little. T touch? Why? Why? Because you got such beautiful skin, no? Very different from me. You have stripes. I have spots. Yeah, here on my tummy. Can you see? Yes, uh, you uh, walk on land and run and I swim in the ocean right off Simon's Town, my hometown in Cape, yeah? And uh, you black and white and I, uh, maybe I also black and white. Okay, maybe that's the same, same, but everything is different. I just want to touch you a little. Uh, Parades? Yes. Can you help me get home? Oh, <laughs> Of course, I can help you. You stay right here. I will send a truck in a few minutes to take you right back, okay? A, a truck? Yes, yes, yes. A truck to take you right back to Mama and Papa, okay? Okay, thank you. Thank you, Poppy Perez. You're welcome, Zippy. Stay right here. Hello, Moss? Yes, goods are ready. You can send the truck. Okay, thank you. Boom, 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 boom. No. What just happened? Oh no. What do you think Perez is going to do to Zippy? All these new people tired Zippy out a lot. <sighs> Zippy laid right down and fell into a deep slumber. You can take a small nap if you like to. Yes? Homelands, homelands, moonlight sleeping in a midnight lake. We are homelands. Homelands, moonlight sleeping in a midnight lake. Somebody sing a jig, 
Aji, Aji, somebody cry. Hello, hello, hello. Somebody sing Aji, 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 somebody cry. Why, why, why? Homeless, homeless. Moonlight sleeping in a midnight lake. Suddenly, two friends came back. Zomina mina, eh eh, waka waka, eh eh, zomina mina, zonga leva. I know what uh uh. I know what uh uh. I know what uh uh. <laughs> you cracked me up, little donkey. <laughs> Cornel, you're the best brother. You're the best brother. <laughs> hey, Cornel, where is Zippy? I told you we shouldn't have left Zippy alone. I'm sure the lions got him, Money Donkey. <laughs> Calm down, brother. Calm down. Let's ask our friends. Uh, friends, have you seen Zippy? Have you seen Zippy? Uh, yes, yes. Where? Where is he? Where is he? What? Where? Where? Uh, behind us? <gasps> oh, I told you he's dead. He's dead. Cornel, shh, stop shouting, brother. He's just sleeping. Really? <coughs> I told you. Oh, thank goodness, thank goodness. The lions didn't teach him, thank goodness. Cornel, how are you going to live life like this, brother? You scared of the lions? Oh, I'm petrified of you scared of the wind? Oh no, too much wind. You scared of the stars, the moon, the sky? The sky, it's too large. It scares me. You even scared of your own shadow, brother. Oh, shadow? Oh, legs. How are you gonna live life like that, huh? Just stop being scared so much all the time. I don't know how to do that. Okay, okay, it's okay. Now remember, we have a very important question to ask our friends. Oh, yes. Did you brush your teeth? Well, Cornell, not that question, brother, even though that is also a very important question. We have another question. What is it? Did Zippy talk to any strangers? Did Zippy speak to any strangers? What? What, what, what? Speak loud, speak loud. Yes! Oh no! He's dead! He's dead! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Calm down! We don't know who he spoke to. Who did he speak to? Come on, tell us in the comments. Who did he speak to? Oh no! A penguin? Oh dear! Oh no! Was it a black and white penguin? <laughs> Cornell! All penguins are black and white, brother. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry. What I mean is, what was his name? Do you guys remember the penguin's name? Tell us, tell us. Poppy Perez? Oh, no. Perez, the gangster penguin. Eh, are you sure? Did he walk like boom, boom, boom? And did he have a necklace? Yes! Oh, great! Zippy, it was nice knowing you, Zippy. Oh, I loved you for five minutes, Zippy. Goodbye, Zippy. Cornell, calm the body, brother. Calm the body. Zippy's still here. We can save him. Are you crazy? Perez is the meanest skin supplier in the whole savannah. Yeah, Cornell, I know that. I know that. You take Zippy to safety and I will deal with Perez, okay? Are you sure, Manu Donkey? Be careful. I will, I will. I'm Manu Donkey, the coolest monkey in the whole of Africa. I know, I know, I know. Okay, okay, now pick up the baby, pick up the baby. Don't wake the baby, Cornell. Ask any parent watching us. Don't wake the baby, right? Okay, okay. Here, yeah, yeah, here, gently. <coughs> okay. okay, gently. Okay, you be gentle too. Okay. Ah! 
Hi bo, hi bo, everybody says. Hi bo, hi bo. Okay, now, my friends, you have to, you have to help me save Zippy from Perez, okay? I'm going to ask Perez some questions, but something tells me he's not gonna tell me the truth. So I want you to shout out the truth, the real answer, as loud and clear as possible. Type it out if you can, okay? Okay, here goes. Let's call Perez. Loudly, loudly. He has he's a bit of hard of hearing, you know? Hmm. Perez! Perez! Oh, what is that monkey troubling me, huh? Perez, come here. Get your tail here. Oh, in the middle of the night, Madhu Donkey, why can't you make an appointment like everyone else? No, I'm very busy. Perez, come here. Eh, you want to order something We are online? Please FB your order and I will deliver it, okay? I don't want to Facebook you. I want to talk to your face. Fine. What is the matter? Please keep your distance. Okay. Where is your mask? Eh. We are animals. We don't wear masks. Okay, okay. Tell me. Okay. I'm going to ask you a simple question. Did you talk to a zebra? No! <gasps> Come on. Tell me the truth. Did Perez speak to a zebra? Loud, loud, shout it out. Type it out. Ah, can you hear them? Can you hear them? No, I can't hear them and I can't see them. And even if they're talking, they're not telling the truth. Okay, 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 Perez. Calm down. I'll give you one more chance, okay? Did you talk to a baby zebra? No! <gasps> Come on. Come on. Tell me the truth. Can you hear that? Shh. Stop shouting. I'll give you one last chance just because I'm a donkey and I have a big heart, okay? But please tell me the truth. Did you speak to a baby zebra named Zippy? No! <gasps> That's it, Perez. He is lying. That's right. Uncle Vire's daughter tells us that he is lying. You are lying. I am not. Shh. This is the first business I've had in two months. Can you be kind to a penguin who's trying to survive? Perez, listen to me. You lay a feather on Zippy the baby and I will make penguin soup and ship you to China in little cans, okay? Okay, okay, Perez. Listen, brother, listen. Eh, my friends, can you help me tell Poppy who is a good friend? Tell us, come on, shout it out or type it out, even better. Who is a good friend? <laughs> read the comments here. But I, I can't read. Okay, fine, I'll read for you. Go on, tell us, who is a good friend? <gasps> oh, yes, yes, a good friend takes care of you. Very good. Give us a few more ideas. Who is a good friend? Who is a good friend? What does a good friend do? 
You never lie. Thank you, Deepti's family. Never lie? Never ever? Even for business? No, no, you never lie, even for business. Yes, Mahin also says you never lie. What else do good friends do? Come on, tell us. Madhu Donkey will read it for me. <gasps> Sanuti says, good friend is someone who is kind. Did you hear that? Someone who is kind. Thank you, Sanuti. Sabiha says, let me read. Oh, small print. They look after people. Someone who looks after their friend. Do you understand, Therese? Yes. Yes. Yes, thank you, Mahin. They help each other too. They protect you. Thank you, Sariyut. Yes. Hello, Revata and Dasharat and Tisaria. They help you. They take care of you. They protect you. Yes, they do not sell your skin, right? They don't? No, not even for business. Not even if they haven't had business in two months. Really? Really. Now, can you be a good friend to Zippy and do what everyone said? Be kind, protect, take care, and most importantly, help him get home. Can you do that? Yes, most. I have lots of contacts in the savannah. No, I'm sure someone can take him home. All right. Now, before you do that, I'm going to send Zippy back to you. And do you know what you have to say to him? What? Eh, when you make a big mistake, what must you say? What must you say? <gasps> That's right. You must say, I'm sorry, Zippy. I'm sorry, brother. I will never hurt you again. I will only help you. Can you say that? Oh, that's too many things to remember. No? Okay, okay, just say sorry. Are you ready? But what if, what if Zippy gets angry at me? What if he gets mad? No, no, no. You know, sometimes... Sometimes it is difficult to say sorry. Sometimes we are scared. Oh, what if mommy gets angry? What if daddy gets angry? What if my best friend never talks to me again? Eh, first say sorry. Everything else will work out. Are you ready? Oh, but I'm scared. Eh, Perez is a little scared to say sorry. Can you help him? Can you help him? Yes, okay. They're ready to help you. Are you ready? I think I'm ready. Okay, stay right here. I'm going to bring Zippy, okay? Okay. Hi, boo. Hi, boo. Everybody says, hi, boo. Hi, boo. Oh, boy. But what if Zippy, what if Zippy hates me? What if Zippy never talks to me again? Maybe, maybe, maybe I should just run and hide and pretend it never happened. No, don't do that. Okay. Oh, Zippy, will you forgive me, Zippy? I'm really sorry, Zippy. Pa, pa, Paris? <gasps> Zippy, oh, Zippy, I'm so sorry, Zippy. Please forgive me, Zippy. <laughs> oh, oh, Paris, wipe your nose somewhere else, please. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Oh, Zippy, please, please forgive me. I'm so sorry, Zippy. I'm so sorry. Perez, Perez, it's okay. Really? Really? It's okay. We all make mistakes. Thank you for saying sorry. Really, Zippy? You don't hate me? No, no, no. Oh, Zippy! Oh, thank you, brother. Thank you. I'll do anything to help you. Perez, mom says that even humans make mistakes sometimes. Really? Really, boss? Do humans also make mistakes sometimes? Do you make mistakes? Yes? See? You're not the only one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Zippy, listen up. Listen up. What can I do for you? 
For real? For real, for real this time. Can you help me get home? Home, home, oh dear, home is very far away, no more. But wait, wait, I have lots of connections. Maybe, maybe you can help me think of someone, an animal who is very large, who can walk very far, and someone who doesn't eat other animals because we don't want Zippy to be eaten, no? On the way home? No, 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 no. We need someone large who other animals are, may also be afraid of. Can you think of someone? Someone who can help Zippy get home? Can you think of someone big? But why does it have to be big, Beres? Because Zippy's tired, no? The animal has to carry Zippy home. Oh, someone large enough to carry Zippy home. Someone who's vegetarian. Someone who won't eat Zippy. Someone who can walk very far, very soon. <gasps> yes, yes. <laughs> Sophie says rhino. Uh, Uncle Vire's daughter says elephant. Elephant or hippo. Sabiha says elephant too. Oh, Deep this family says elephant. Do you guys know an elephant? Oh, yes, Moss. Yes, yes. Now I remember. I can call Ellie the biggest mama elephant in the whole savannah. An African elephant? Yes, an African elephant. Oh, nobody will mess with mama Ellie. Let me, let me try, okay? You stay right here, okay? Okay. Ellie, Ellie. Do you really think Ellie will help Zippy get back to his herd safe and sound? Really? Do you think that? Shall we all call Ellie the mama elephant? Yes, a big African elephant. Can you help me? Say Ellie, Ellie, loud, loud, loud. It's really dark and it's in the savannah, so Ellie might be very far away. Shout out Ellie with me. Come on. Ellie. Ellie. Eh, who is disturbing my beauty sleep in the middle of the night for crying out loud? I've been watching babies all day long. I just went to sleep. Ellie. Someone needs your help, another baby. Another baby, no, 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 no. I told the father elephant, all babies are his responsibility after 10 p.m. I'm done with babies. No, no, not an elephant baby, another baby, a zebra baby. A zebra baby, no, 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 that's not right. Zebras don't come this far out in the savannah. Yes, Zippy is lost. Can you tell Ellie what happened, guys? What? What? He was chasing butterflies. Oh, that's strange for a zebra. Really? He went away from his herd? Chasing butterflies. Hmm. What a brave little baby. Eh, but the savannah is no place for babies after that. Zippy, where are you? Zippy, Zippy. Ellie, 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 Ellie. Right under your foot. What? What? Oh, oh, you really are a baby. Hi, Mama Ellie. Hello, hello. Eh, you're very far from home. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's a long story. Oh, that's all right. Your friends told me. Come on, climb on my back. Climb on your back? Yeah, yeah, come on. Through the trunk. Come on, come on. Quickly, quickly. Oh, ow, ow. Ow, my eye, ow, no, no, track, ow, ow, nose, eyes, 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 ow, oh. Wow. Ellie, I can see the whole savannah. <laughs> you sit tight, baby. I'll get you all the way home. Thank you so much, Ellie. Now you can bring your favorite toy right up to the screen and sing Zippy the Zebra with me.
Ready? Zippy the zebra, zippy the zebra, zippy the zebra, zippy the zebra. Mama Ellie walked through the night along with Francine the fish, Madu Donkey the monkey, Cornell the cheetah, Perez the penguin, and of course, Mama Ellie all the way back to Zippy's herd to deliver him safe and sound to his mama and papa. And all the zebras were amazed to see that Zippy had made so many new, different, strange friends. Zippy the zebra, Zippy the zebra, Zippy the zebra, Zippy the zebra, Zippy is so brave. Zippy's got a lot of new friends. Zippy is so brave. Zippy's got a lot of new friends. Zippy the zebra, Zippy the zebra, Zippy the zebra, Zippy the zebra. And that's how a tiny baby zebra went all the way far away in the savannah and met animals that even mama and papa zebra had never met before and brought them all back to the herd with him. Wow, so <laughs> that was our first original performance back in Sri Lanka, all the way back in 2010, Zippy the Zebra. And it's inspired by all my experiences living and working in South Africa. Um, I want to invite all our little friends, if you've got some art supplies lying around, over here, uh, just maybe, or even just scrap paper, that's fine, and some crayons. I would love it if you could quickly draw something inspired by this story. It could be your favorite character from the story, or it could be the character you did not like. But make sure you tell us why. Why is it your favorite character, and why is it the character that you don't like? Or maybe you could even tell us a brand new chapter to this story. What happens when all these new animals go back with Zippy to meet his herd? Is there more adventures for Zippy? You can write as well as draw your own chapter for this story. Or you could even tell us a time you've been brave. Have you been brave? It can be little things like, Actually, it's a really big thing to say sorry when you've made a mistake. That takes a lot of bravery. Yes? Or have you been brave in, in staying at home for such a long time, missing your friends, but still doing something positive every day? Helping out family members, being kind to each other. That takes a lot of bravery. Even when you're feeling a little sad inside, trying to be kind and nice to others, yes? Or even listening to your own sadness. That's also brave. It can be anything that you want. So just draw a picture and make sure mom and dad takes a picture of it and send it to us on our Facebook page. Wow, we are almost close to an hour. <laughs> I'm just going to give everyone two minutes. If your little ones want to ask a question about Zippy or any of the other animals, um, or if they want to ask me a question about how this story came to be, you can just type them out now. We'll take about two, maximum three questions. And the big ones are also welcome to ask. It doesn't have to be a little one. But I do encourage, um, if the big ones are typing, don't edit your kids' questions. They ask the best and the most honest questions. So don't worry, yeah? Just type out um, the question as they ask it. <laughs> Hello. Hi, Ryoni from Australia and the whole family who's listening to us. Varna Tama, Susanta Siya, Hiranti Lokwama, Lakshmi Mahapa, and Nushara. Welcome, Sansa. Hi, Kanisha. <laughs> I 
Any questions you guys have? <laughs> Thank you, Mahin. <laughs> Thank you so much. Sanuti wants to know if Zippy is real. Well, here's the story. Um, I was in South Africa in 2009, and um, my friend, my housemate, I lived in Grahamstown, which is a tiny town um, in the East Cape of South Africa. And my housemate, a wonderful woman named Jane, uh, took me to Addo Elephant Park, and there are thousands of animal about elephants in Addo Elephant Park in South Africa. You can just type that on YouTube and you can see so many videos of African elephants. And she's the one who told me, do you know why zebras have stripes? Do you guys know why? Yes, because when they stick to a herd and when they stand far away together, their stripes camouflage them so lions can't see them. They just blend to the background because of their stripes and because there's so many of them. But here's the really interesting fact. If a zebra is alone, the stripes can actually highlight them. So if you're in a herd, the stripes protect you. But if you're alone, the stripes can actually work against you. And this was fascinating to me because me, from the time I was a child, I never wanted to stick to a herd. Like Francine and Madudonke, <laughs> I was not a fan of the herd. And there were lots of negative consequences. And this was also 2009, so the big people watching us know what, like, what that was like for Sri Lanka. 2009 was a difficult year for us, yes. Um, it was also a wonderful year, but it was also a difficult year because we came out of a dark, dark period. And during that time, this whole thing of sticking to a side was playing in my mind you know you had to pick a side you know you couldn't not pick a side so i was thinking of all of these things and i thought there's a saying i don't know who said it i'll look it up uh if something's too complex for adults make it into a children's story so that's what inspired zippy the zebra the importance of following your own passion following your own mind doing what's right even if that takes you away from the herd, and even if that's scary sometimes, having the guts to stand your own ground. So is Zippy real? I know many Zippies in the animal world, and I also know many Zippies uh, in the human world, and I love them all, and I salute them all for standing their own ground. Uh, so for me, Sanuti, yes, Zippy is very real. And there, there you go. It's right there. <laughs> Great. So, um, hello, welcome to our friends from Ottawa and um, uh, from everywhere else in the world who's joining us. Thank you so much. Um, I'm going to sign off now uh, because we we uh, we keep getting questions. Let me let me respond to them slowly and take my time with them. Uh, thank you so much, Ioma. <laughs> thank you, Sherwin. Thank you for joining. I want you guys remember to draw a picture inspired by Zippy the Zebra and get mom and dad to send it our way and we will share it in our next live video. And a big shout out to everyone who joined our Vesak live as well last week. We'll be sharing your pictures next week as well. Thank you. This has been absolutely wonderful. Thank you so much. I'm going to say bye-bye. And all these beautiful puppets are going to say bye-bye too. And thank you so much to my own uh, back office support. <laughs> and all the my parents who banded together for childcare. Thanks, Priyatama and Disasia. Thank you so much for allowing us to do what we love. See you guys at 4.30 p.m. next Saturday. Oops, Zippy fell over. <laughs> See you guys next Saturday at 4.30 p.m. with another new story. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful, wonderful Saturday and a wonderful weekend. Bye-bye. Stay safe.